Seven times two for the owner name. Seven times two for the teams. All right, all right. Lucky number seven. First randoms finished. Lucky number seven. Good luck, everybody, in the autographed hockey puck. Now you can see your team in the break. Oh, my. I'm going to put this in alphabetical order real fast. What's it going to be coming out of here? Autographed hockey puck hit parade. Oh, this is going to be a bigger hit. Anytime you see that, it's going to be a bigger hit. And all this is a promo that says, hey, show it off. Email a picture of you and your family, your favorite pet to here and I'll ship this with this to the winner what is it it's going to be a nicer hit because anytime you see that that's going to be a nicer hit what is it whose autograph are we looking at right here all-star game LA 02 2002 maybe somebody already knows whose autograph we're looking at it is oh 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 my it's Jagger ho nice all right so uh, let's see. I don't know who's going to get this. I don't know who is going to get this yet. Let me see. Played from 1991 to 2008. Oh, I don't know. And see, that's the thing. I mean, it, typically, now typically, I'm not saying this break. Typically, our rule is uh, longest tenure uh, when it's an unidentified team. 
But this is celebrating the All-Star Game in 2002. And so as we look over at 2002, he was uh, he was with the Nationals. So I'm not I'm not sure. You know how this is going to work if if it goes to the Capitals or it would either be between the Capitals or the the um, the Pittsburgh Penguins. And maybe the same person owns both teams. Let me see about that. That that could make things really easy. Uh, who who has the Penguins? Otherwise, I'll be looking into the rules pretty heavily here. Uh, but Penguins owned by Larry. Capitals owned by Craig. So, yeah, I'll be digging in to some of the rules. There's an inscription here, which could make a big difference. You know, if it's a, if it's a number inscription um, from when he was with the Capitals. Uh, no, he wore 68 his whole career. 68 is the number that's shown here. Okay, so that doesn't help us. I would guess it would probably go to longest tenure team. That's what I would guess. But it is an O2 puck. And it is celebrating the O2 All-Star Game. And so it may go to the Capitals. I'm going to have to confer with our team uh, to make sure I award this correctly. I haven't run into this too often. So I'm going to postpone awarding this hit. I'm going to postpone it until I can be 100% sure I'm, I go by the, all of our rules. And uh, so I'll make a part two of this video coming up in a few minutes. I'm going to give our team uh, the message and, you know, confer with everybody about how to award this correctly. So um, I just want to be on the safe side. I don't want to award it and award it to the wrong person. That's just me. I don't, uh, we do so many box breaks and there's so many different rules. I just want to make sure that it would go to longest tenure before I award it to longest tenure. That's my thought. It was, it would go to longest tenure, but it's, it is celebrating that all-star game. So like I said, it's kind of one of those interesting, interesting, um, very, very rare situational type of pucks. And, uh, we will have a part two for this soon. Uh, wow. What a great hit. What a great hit. Hope.